Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Stephanie and I'm back here again with another bag review. Um, so today, our bag of choice is the Chloe Pillow Tabby in the ombre color. Um, just even I'm looking at her, I'm like, God, stunning. You know that feeling when you buy a bag but you haven't looked at it for a little while and then you pull it back out again and you're like, wow, what a stunning bag? That's how I feel. Anywho, if you're new here, my name is Stephanie and I post about whatever's on my mind, whether it be travel, bags, or just any random things that I come across in New York City. Um, I've been living here for about two years now and I love it. The sun is beaming right now and it's actually 36 degrees outside so you would never know any better. But follow along, like, and subscribe down below if you're curious to learn more. Um, I'll, I try to post videos once a week on Sundays. Stick around if you want to know more. This bag, um, you know the pillow craze has been wild these days. Um, when I bought this bag, I was in Soho at the coach store. And honestly, it was this chain that sold me. Um, you can find this bag at Nordstrom. Like I was literally at Bloomingdale's the other day. And you can find the bag itself. On Nordstrom for sale but it doesn't come with this strap and um, I was that I think this is what makes it for me so right now online this bag is at the coach outlet for $270 which is it retailed for $450 I can't find the other the extra strap anywhere so I'm not sure if they still sell it but Regardless, the strap, this bag by itself without the straps is still super, super cute. Let me see. Just like that. Um, but regardless, highly recommend the bag if you have the chance to get it. It comes in multiple ombre colors. So there's this one. It comes in this um, green, pink, blue hue ombre color. And then it also comes in a orange, red, white ombre color and there's also a plain blue and you, I'm sure you've seen the tabbies all around they're all over the place um, very nice very very soft um, they feel amazing um, and they're not too thick or anything like that just a really nice bag to hang out and carry like with your girlfriends on a night out so some specs about the bag um, it's Napa leather um, there's an inside multi-functioning pocket snap closure fabric lining um, detachable both of the detach the both of the handles are detachable so you can detach this one you can detach this one and then there's also a long crossbody strap that it comes with as well that you could put on the side I am a crossbody person but I actually prefer this bag as a top handle I just think it sits on the arm really cute um, I've gotten quite a few compliments about this bag as well she's so cute she's so stunning I love taking her out and about um, tiny bag energy of course like it she doesn't fit that much but she fits the essentials and I don't care that much either um, it is a traditional snap closure and the detachable long strap has a 21 and a half whoop, 21 and a half inch drop for shoulder or crossbody wear um, the style number is CA084. So here, I'll show you some shots of the bag. <laughs> this is the chain. Also ombre, so it kind of matches it perfectly. You have the coach signature right here. Open it up. You have crossbody strap, also ombre, and then a back pocket here, and one there. This is this is the petite 18 version. I know that there's a 26, and then I believe there's like a 48 or something, but like she's petite, okay? She is TBE, tiny bag energy. Um, well, she's not the tiniest of the tiny bags, but she's still a tiny bag. So I actually found the chain. Um, so I had to buy the bag and then I bought the bag in store and then the chain came afterwards um, because when I was in store, somebody purchased the, the last chain that they had in store right before me, which is why I ended up buying purchasing it on the spot because I was like, I don't want them to run out of these chains and I don't regret it. Um, so the chain, it's the short LTR chain strap 
Um, the style ID is CA088. Um, it's wash chambray multi and it was $195. So the total for the chain itself was $212.30. And then the bag itself, Okay, so I bought the bag for $4.50 flat, so I paid full price for it. Definitely go and get it at the outlet or at Bloomingdale's or Nordstrom if you are looking at it for now. Um, so in total, I paid for the bag plus the strap $702.24. So worth it. I, my cost per wear is minimal right now because, you know, I'd be wearing this girl out. And and uh, I'm not sure if you saw the, the Chloe double carry video that I posted before, but this C re resembles a little bit the Chloe C as well, which is why some people confuse the Chloe, the Chloe C for the Coach C. Um, as you can see, they, they're both C's, very strong, very vibrant, white right in the front um, of the bag. So not, not, I mean, Coach is stepping it up, right? If I do say so myself. So now, any qualms with the bag? I don't have any qualms with the bag. Um, I Obviously, it doesn't fit that much, but like, you know, I knew what I was getting myself into. It feels very, very soft. Sometimes I do take this off just because it like jumbles within all of this and it makes it hard to like pull the bag up. Um, also, I don't usually wear it with this strap up. Um, I You can wear it on your shoulder, but as you can see, like, Sometimes this gets caught on the side and they like pull at the leather and it makes it crease. So you don't like that, but you can wear it like this if you wanted to. Um, I personally, I don't wear it like this too often. I just wear it on my shoulder like this. And I kind of like how the look, how it looks like with just a full circle. I just like that. I have never worn it with the crossbody strap. Uh, it probably won't be soon either. But regardless, let me show you what fits inside the bag. So, let me see starting with my keys because those are the most important and they have to fit in i put those right in the front right there and then my wallet i put at the back um wallet like you obviously wouldn't be able to full fit a full size wallet so it has to be a kind of coin purse or um card holder or something like that and then i have my airpods pop those right in the front um ysl libre test tube, um, quarter balm, let's see, in there. And then I kind of just stuff whatever else like is important in the back. Uh, so it'll be uh, my glasses cleaner, stuff that back there. Another, either another, oh my God, this is chewed, this has been chewed up by the dog that I was watching. Or some hand sanitizer, so I'll probably try, nope, it doesn't work. So just another thing. So, you know, very compact, but still fit, fit the essentials. Um, I got like two chapsticks in here, my keys, my wallet, um, my AirPods, and another chapstick. So, and it's not heavy at all. So you can definitely fit a lot of good stuff in there. Look at, she's so stunning. I love looking at a bag and being like, wow, I'm so proud I bought you. So yeah, that's my, this is the Chloe Double Carry. Uh, not Chloe Dub. <laughs> this is the Coach Pillow Tabby in 18 Ombre. Um, I will insert some mod shots now um, of how I've styled it or like how I've worn it in the past, um, just so you can just get a taste of that. Alrighty, 
So that was my bag review. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, don't hesitate to comment down below. Um, as I said, I post about whatever's on my mind, travel, bags, beauty, lifestyle, anything like that. Um, so if you're curious to learn more, definitely like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Where's Wee Woo, and I will catch you guys in the next one.